Hey, I know that the other video covered everything we did today, but I just want to do it on the base. Oh, yeah. All right. What I wanted you to see on here was the first step is to do a pluck on our right hand and go from the first fret to the third fret. It's a slide. Do it with all the different fingers on all the strings you have. And even the pinky, if you want. It's just gonna make you stronger, uh, but it is harder to do that. What happens is you end up turn, uh, pushing your pinky down and you get, get actually lots of good uh, movements with it, being able to be super mobile for later. Uh, anywho, I'm gonna go for the third part last. The third part last is a B octave, so we've got two and four, B and B, B to D, D to C sharp, then C. My right hand is doing a and I'm overdoing it so you can see it. Anyway, it does a B, D, C sharp, C, B, D, C sharp, C, B, D, C sharp, C, B, D, C sharp, C. At this point, we go all the way up to the seventh fret and we play E, E flat, D, C, same style. Lower note, then high note. We do that twice and then we go back to the B, D, D flat, C, B, D, C sharp, C. Here we go to the F sharp on the second. Go all the way up to the fifth fret, A, A flat, G, and then to the E, E flat, D, D flat, back to the original B. B, D, D flat, C, B, D, D, D. Here's what the whole thing looks like in one fluid motion. this point we go to the second fret and hit the B B A G G sharp A uh, D C sharp C D so we're basically skipping two four five four two five four three two Goes back into that twice, and then at the end it just drops back into the boom, bam, da, doom, ba, boom, 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 boom. So it switches from the uh, four, four, back into seven. I hope that makes sense. If you have questions, give me a buzz here in the comments. Aloha.